SVG files are becoming more and more popular on XE. If you are unfamiliar with SVGs, they are scalable vector graphic files. They can be used to create detailed images and graphics. In this video, I will show you how to use Canva to create SVG files that you could use to sell on XE. So let's go ahead and dive right in. All right, so here we are on Canva, and you must have a Canva Pro account in order to use the SVG feature. If you don't have one, make sure to use my referral link. I will leave it right below this video so you could try out Canva Pro for 30 days for free, and then later on the side if you want to upgrade or not. And another thing that I recommend is uploading your own graphic license that you purchase instead of using Canva elements. Um, as you probably know, Canva's licensing terms are a little bit confusing. So if you do end up using their elements, make sure that you get some clarification directly from them if you have any additional questions. So for the sake of this video, I am going to be using Canva elements just to illustrate how easy it is to create an SVG file. So the first thing I'm going to do is click um, click here, create a design, and I'm just going to do a standard post 2000 by 2000 pixels. And I'm going to go under elements and I'm going to type in woman and try to find an element here that I like. So let's say that I want to go ahead and let me just do graphics that way no videos show up. So let me say I want to do this one here, right? and go ahead and size it to your posts and let's go ahead and add some text as well so i'm just going to type in strong woman now once you have created your design and you're happy with it you like how it looks you added all the colors that you wanted um, it's so simple after this so i'm just going to do the, my final touches here so let's say that this is what I want my SVG to look like. I'm happy with how it looks and that's all I'm going to do with it, right? So once I'm happy with the actual design, all you need to do is just pretty much click on share and then scroll down where it says download. Now what you want to do is click on this navigation bar right here and go down to SVG. Make sure that you click on transparent background. So therefore it doesn't have a background. And once you're happy with the design and you do this step, go ahead and download the design. It will take a few seconds to download. Always check your design just to make sure that it looks clear. This one actually looks really, really great as you can see. And this is how simple it is to create SVG files. Keep in mind that when you're uploading your own graphics, all you're gonna do is click here where it says upload to create your own. Let me know if you plan to use it and I will see you in the following video.